Hello guys and welcome to the third part of the game series. In this video I'm going to show you how to change the color of your eye and I know I made a tutorial about this but it was not in GIMP. So I'm going to show you how right now. So I'm going to select my uh well I'm just going to show you right away. Um so you can by the way zoom out here we have some kind of percentage. Just click on one hundred percent and it should go back to normal so uh, select your uh, loop thingy uh, uh, magnify glass I mean Mag yeah, well I th think you know what I mean so you'll just select uh, the thing what you wanna zoom into so let's zoom a little bit more in so this is I uh, will okay so this is just right so I'm going to select my uh, free select tool this one and I'm going to draw uh, well uh, well I have to do this over uh, well just I'm just going to do this pretty quickly you can yeah you probably uh, should take some more time so um, when you've done that press control X X and what it does is it, uh, it, uh, it, uh, well, it's the same as a uh, cut. See, Control X. This is cut. Control X. So you've cut that. So create a new layer and type in uh, I only something and press OK. So what you want to do is go to uh, well, you can do any kind of tool. So do this one, uh, right mouse button, edit, and then paste or control V like that well well it's not right in place actually so yeah nearly well I think this is just going to be good enough for me so let's see how this looks like when you are assumed that Okay, so you can see that. So you will have to. F uh, we are going to fix it. Um, so I'm going to select my uh, background. This one. So the empty eye. Co uh, colors and then colorify or something like that. Uh, oh well. Let's first select like. Uh, well, let's take our uh, free select tool again. Oh well, first zoom in like that. So now select it again and roughly draw like that. Okay. So now we're going to do that again. So now you see this will come, and we're going to create that and uh, make that wide. So press OK. So now. Uh, the dark blue, all the blue colors are just uh, vanished, so we don't want to see that. So, back again here, we're going to select the eye layer. Yeah, well, now we can do uh, this one. I don't know how to call it the third from above with the three dots. So, now we can see we changed uh, already some color. Uh, well, you can do kind of anything actually. Well, it doesn't look that nice. Uh, well, it's going to be nicer when you put some more time in, but we're not ready yet. So let's do this. Ah, well, this purple is really nice actually. So press OK. I have this. Now, what I'm going to do is um, go to uh, uh, filters and then blur and then the first one um, and you can see the example again well this is really too much so you just want like one is just enough I think and now we're going to uh, take the background again select our lasso tool well it's not called a lasso tool but I call it like that because it's most of the time called lasso tool so do it again with it um, one, maybe, um, three is going to be, uh, six, I mean, is going to be enough. 
so see now we are well now we have some kind of ugly eye you really have to put more time in it um, maybe we can fix it by going to blur um, the eye just one more but then you have not that kind of clear eye okay so it's kind of rubbish but when you put more time in it it's going to be very nice actually um, yeah so um, now the eye isn't that clear so let's do uh, uh, well let's undo that by eat it and then undo or press controls that um, ah oh well um, so it's actually uh, the most uh, consuming time is in the in ah uh, well is going to be in uh, make uh, how do you say that the most consuming time is going to be uh, selecting only the eye it's very important you did that right otherwise you'll get this and you don't want that actually but okay so I did this pretty quick because I have a time limit so yeah um, I would uh, <laughs> well I hope actually I could make this one better but well it's just on time and I don't have enough time for that so yeah, thanks for watching this video. Uh, feel free to comment, rate, subscribe, or email me. Um, my email address is gnbjbnk at gmail.com. Um, uh, if you have some money over, please donate to me at gnbjbnk at gmail.com via PayPal. Or, um, well, do say that easier, my YouTube account at gmail.com. So, thanks for watching this video. Um, uh, please uh, view my previous parts um, and view my next parts, parts if they are online. So thanks for watching again and I'll catch you later.